Hi kiddos, it's Riley. And today we have a very special guest. This is my sister Amanda, whom I'm pretty sure you guys have not met before on her aggression so. channel. She's been in some videos on my main channel before and it was just her birthday, so big happy birthday. And we are going to do a little Q&A. So I asked you guys on Instagram to ask questions for me and for Amanda regarding my regression and Adri in general. So we are going to look through some of those and I'll share my perspective, she'll share her perspective and it'll be fine. So let's get started. So someone wants to know, what were your first impressions of Adri and how has your sibling changed that? Oh, um, I didn't know it existed. Not, not really. Like, I mean, I knew it was a thing, but I never thought it was as big as it is and was as had different communities and all the different things it could be. Yeah, no, that's totally fair. <laughs> what did you first think about regression when I first told you? I think my exact words were, so your mind goes to a five-year-old and you dress like a baby? And Riley's like, yes, but it's more than that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, def definitely more than that. But you're just like, huh. Somebody else wants to know, are you in the Adri community as well? Are you a care, a small, or anything in the community? No, not, I mean, I'm so, uh, I, I support the community. I support everybody's right to be who they want to be and all that, but, yeah, but I'm not, not a participating not, person in the community. Yeah, you're no. not. Yeah, you don't regress yourself or care for regressors or anything like no. that. Who's the better singer? Yeah, I would say so as well. Do you ever feel like you have to be a big sister in a way if I regress around you? I feel that when you're not regressed around <laughs> me. <laughs> It's funny because it's pretty, had, it's pretty true. Yeah, we, we switch on, like, he's older than me. Obviously. But we but we, we switch the protective over, older sibling role back and forth. Yeah, we do. Did you ever think Adri was weird? Weird is not always bad. I'll call it weird if it's something I'm unfamiliar with or I am not into. So by that definition, yes, I thought it was weird. But with that being said, obviously nobody... It, yeah, I, we all get what you're saying. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think anyone less or more because they're into something. Yeah, because they do something. It is, you're, in what, you're into what you're into. Did you start treating me differently when, after I told you that I regressed? I don't think so. No, I don't think so either. I, I, I don't think she did. I mean, she pokes fun at me a little bit sometimes, but like, <laughs> other, other than that, there's not really... I mean, she's over here right now helping me rearrange the whole regression room and yeah. get it all set up. So, what is it like to have siblings or a family who supports your age regression? It's awesome. Really, really cool. Because I know there are a lot of people out there who don't have that situation. And parents think it's weird or they automatically think it's a kink thing or, you know, and people have a lot of misunderstandings about it and I think mom and dad were kind of confused at first but they kind of grew on it like and they realized that as long as I wasn't hurting myself or hurting anyone else that it really didn't matter yeah and it's it's nice to have that perspective and when back when I had a shop my dad helped me run the shop it's really nice to have that supportive family because I don't have to hide anything which is nice and when I got excited about having my own place so I could have a regression room I didn't get weird looks or nope. anything like that they were actually pretty excited for me which was pretty cool <laughs> how do you feel with your sibling being an age regressor and how do you feel about age regression in general I definitely see how it's helped you and how it's a in a way it helps you cope with things that have happened in your life I, de I defend people online who are getting harassed for things like this because I know firsthand by observing you seeing how how this helps you in your life and how worse off you'd be if you didn't have it yeah and you didn't have the supportive community that you have with your age yeah. regression yeah I, I definitely 
agree with that, yeah. What are your boundaries when interacting with me when I'm regressed? I don't think we've had. We haven't really talked about that. I've been regressed around her before. And yeah. She doesn't really care. Sometimes I have to drive. <laughs> <and sit in. laughs> yeah, no, and it, usually it's one of those things where it's like if we go out somewhere together and I drove, and then suddenly I rem I'm regressing. I'm like, hey, can you drive? <laughs> yeah. And she's like, or I cook. Or, or or she cooks instead. But it's just little things like that, and we get a lot of. Our family is also like super into Disney and things like that, yes. like cartoons, and so that's a normal thing for us to watch. So I don't think you mind very much if I'm regressed while we're watching a cartoon. Not and really, no. Yeah, uh, it's not that big of a deal. So we don't really, there aren't really boundaries because you don't really act like as a carer or anything. I mean, you just act as a sibling, yeah, like you do when I'm not regressed, and. I mean, you do treat me a little bit differently. You treat I don't me more make like fun a, of you. No, you don't make fun of me, and you, <laughs> no, you make you make fun of me when I'm not regressed all the time, which is fine. That's fine. That's the dynamic we have. <laughs> but when I'm regressed, you don't do that, and you treat me more like a child, which is what you should do <laughs> when yeah. you're around somebody who's regressing. So, how did you find out about my regression? I think you explained it to me, but I didn't fully understand it until I walked into the basement. And there was like a whole playground set up in our basement. <laughs> that is true. I had a friend coming over and I put out a play mat and I had so many bags of diapers set up as like a play pen around the play mat. It was great. I had, I, cause I had all my toys out at the time <laughs> and all of that. And you saw it all and you're like, holy crap. <laughs> I was like, what's happening? Did we adopt a kid I don't know about? What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> that would probably, I think that was probably a turning point for mom and dad too. When they yeah. were like, okay, this is the thing now. This is, this is what it is. <laughs> How much younger are you? Three years. Four years. No, three years three, and months. Four years and months. I'm 21 turning 22 this year. I'm 17 turning. You were born in 03. Yeah, Matt. I was born in 98. So like four years. Four and a half years-ish, yeah. roughly. Was it a more of a major event when I told you or was it more like a eh, okay moment? Eh, okay. <laughs> Figures. Have you ever done activities with me while I've been regressed? So like crafts or coloring or and Probably like crafts. Yeah, I think we've done crafts and we've played games too. Yeah. Especially, we do board games a lot when I regress, when we're together, and board games are very fun. What is your favorite Disney movie and character? I don't have an answer for that. My favorite Disney princess is Cinderella, and my favorite overall full Disney movie has to be Peter Pan, probably. Peter Pan is a really great one. It's definitely on the top list of mine. Yeah. In hindsight, did you ever notice things about my regression before I told you? Yes. Give me some examples. We shared a bathroom. Let's start there. That's true. <laughs> yeah. I accidentally like leave a pacifier and like our childish bubble bath stuff. Our bubble baths and toys. And... Um. Yeah. I mean, I noticed. I was like, at least it's not underwear. And then I left. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think is the best part about age regression as a whole? Whether it's for me, your observation from the outside. It seems like one of the definitely best parts of it is how much it helps people's mental health. I I would agree with that, yeah. No, it definitely it, it definitely provides a very safe and comfortable and loving space and that's what it's supposed to do yeah. um voluntary regression most of the time involuntary can be like that too but then sometimes involuntary can also be impure and we've talked about that a lot on this channel so that is all of the questions that we have mm -hmm. thank you so much for coming and of being course. on the channel and saying hi to everyone <laughs> if you would like to see more age regression content from me you can subscribe to this channel because I post over here a couple of times a week but if you would like to keep up with me day to day in between uploads you can follow me over on Instagram which is at crayons and pencils or over on Twitter which is at crayon kiddo 
I have a Ko-Fi linked down in the description where you can tip me for the price of a coffee and those all really help me out and I appreciate all of them. As well as a wish list if you want some ideas for your own. I love you guys so 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 much and I'll see you soon. Goodbye!